Hey everybody, it's me, Henny B. Henny B speaks. You all know I can't look at you. I am in the vehicle. Getting ready to go to a hair appointment. And I, of course, as usual, got a little message that I wanted to share with you all. And I'm hoping that it encourages you. Um, so I don't know if you've ever had a good day or bad day <laughs> I'm sure if you've been living long enough you've known to experience um, and you might not call yours a bad day maybe you don't call it a bad day maybe you call it something else maybe you say you know um, an interesting day but regardless of what type of day you call it um, any days that aren't necessarily the best day or good days um, that's that's what I'm talking about and um, one of the songs that just came to mind is, um, I forget, uh, Paul, Paul Mork? I think that's who sings it. Um, but the song goes a little something like this. I've had some good days. I've had some hills to climb. You all remember that song? I've had some weary days. And some sleepless nights But when I, I look around And I think things over All of my good days I'll away my bad days I, I won't complain Because the Lord has been good to me He's been good to me You all remember that song, right? Okay So, with that song It just made me really think about Like, man, you know Because I, I, I had a, a day, a rough day Not the whole day But, you know, just moments sometimes Can um, uh, Dark moments Or sad moments Or whatever moments that aren't, aren't necessarily happy um, can sometimes overshadow everything else that's going on good in your life. Sometimes, I don't know about you, but sometimes I have the tendency to focus on the things that are um, that are bad first versus looking at the good things first. Um, so it's just really interesting. I'm just learning that about myself. So with that being said, this song is just so powerful in that I don't care if you had a, a good day or a bad day. Um, just know that there are better good days than there are bad days. So I want you to shift your perspective today that regardless of what is going on in your life, what happened yesterday, you don't have to bring it into today, but I know that that's much easier said than done. But just know that while you do have your good moments, that you do have your happy moments um, until you get over those bad moments, I want you to maximize that time that you're having those good days, those good moments, because you know that if you are going into a bad moment or an unhappy moment, sometimes you don't feel like necessarily doing those things that God has called you to. You might not feel like fulfilling your purpose during those moments. And I know that during those moments when you push through are the most powerful ones. But, you know, realistically, most people, if they are having a moment, they're not trying to um, fulfill their purpose at that moment. They really just want to sit. They want to relax. They want to go under the covers. They, you know, they just kind of want to be in a funk. And I'm not saying anything is wrong with that. I'm just saying that when you are not in those moments, when you are in your happy moments, knowing that other moments might come, try to maximize those time periods, okay? Maximize those happy moments. So if you know that you are, you're in a good space right now, use that good space and achieve the things that you know that you've been, uh, that you're supposed to. So that way you don't procrastinate when you are in your bad moments hopefully that makes sense and just remember that your good days outweigh your bad your good days outweigh your bad your good days outweigh your bad if you want to reach me book me hennybspeaks at gmail.com i can be found on facebook at hennybspeaks 
or um, YouTube, Hanny B Speaks. I look forward to chatting with you all soon and don't forget to command your day.